Now, hello. This is a note on how to update the s the um, the file sources for the image import uh, to OpenCPN using the WeatherFax plugin. Uh, the latest uh, the latest version ha is not up to date on those files. Uh, and they make an announcement of that. They, the, the, the product itself warns you to do that. Um, but I just want to illustrate how to do that. I had a little bit of a snag myself, and that's why I want to share uh, what I've learned about doing that. Um, the, okay, so you download the, here's the icon here for the weather facts, and here's the process if you say then retrieve and from the internet, and then some of these will work, like if you go to maybe German, uh, European, you know, and then click one of these and say uh, uh, selected. So look at that, it's just downloading beautifully. And, and because those haven't changed, see, and you get, th this is the fantastic functionality of this device, you see, of this function, of this uh, plugin. So there's that, all geo-referenced, a beautiful live, uh, you know, most recent data. Now, however, if we go back to like, uh, let me go back here. And I just want to show you how it fails. So let me go to OPC Atlantic. And then let's say I want the Atlantic Ocean Analysis, which is, which is in fact what we're after right now. So I just highlight that one and then say download. And you see it fails. And the reason it fails is because the reference document in here that's saying where the files are is not... Um, is not uh, right. This uh, o o the Ocean Prediction Center changed their name, changed their web page. All right. So this is what we have to fix. This this section right here. And so that's what I want to show you. And then I'll give you a link of where you can download uh, the correct file to import here and uh, do that. And I have imported that. Here's the file we were going to want to use over here on my desktop and uh, so forth. So for now, we can just close this program and open a, um, uh, what do they call these, um, File Explorer. And the File Explorer. And then you go in uh, to um, the local drive C. And I'm just showing you where this is located. And you go into the Program Files x86. And then we go to um, OpenCPN, which is here. And you go to Plugins, which is here. And I've got a lot of plugins. There's so many good plugins for this program. OK, then WeatherFax PI. That's the one we're after. You open that. And then here we go. This is it, data. OK. And these are the uh, various functions that enter into the use of this. But here is the fellow we want right here and I, I just now installed this plugin and these all came the 41419 maybe last time they were updated or something rather but this is the one we want to replace right here with this one that we're going to download I've just downloaded it put the new one on my desktop exactly the same name so what you can do then is just go in here and delete this guy uh, Delete. Okay, he's gone. Now I take this guy and just drag it in here. Now it says you have to have permission. Now this is not a very tough permission. I just said yes. Now originally I had some trouble here actually changing anything in this folder. So you may have to go in and maybe right click the data folder and look at properties and then uh, see this says read only. Read only. So you would then have to go in and maybe change that. Or that's, that's an issue that you have to work out about how you can go in and edit that, edit that file. If I, I have some notes on that that were passed on to me by Rick, which I'll put in the discussion, which is a, maybe a way around that if that's a problem. Anyway, so that's then fixed. That's the new guy that we made uh, today. And then what's now? Now we see if it works. Okay. Actually, yeah. I haven't tested this. So, um, 
Okay, I'm back. I had to pause for a minute. Um, and so now we've got the new file in there and things should work properly. Here is now we open that. Here's some I just did a test. but uh, And so you see these are different files now you can download. So you go to the internet and maybe here Atlantic um, 24 hour forecast. Click it and then that downloads immediately like that. So uh, that's a very powerful tool and that works now and then I'll put the link to where you get this file. Uh, I'll put the link in the discussion.